All right, what's going on guys? I'm back for another video. Today I just kinda wanna give you guys a quick little update about what I've been doing on the ZX-12R, kinda tell you guys about some of the plans that I have of what I'm gonna be doing it throughout the winter here. So, as you can see, I've got it uh, pretty well torn apart. Um, and I haven't really done anything like too special on it so far. Really all I've done was I took the old big one piece fairing thing off of it. I got the air compressor taken out that just pressurized the um, the air shifter. The air shifters really don't use all that terribly much air for each race, so it's kind of almost pointless to have the air compressor because the guy said he really just used it to kind of top it off when it would start to get low. And also I know a lot of people actually use CO2 for air shifters, so I'm probably gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be getting a CO2 tank and using CO2 in my air shifter. I also got the wheel off. I'm actually going to be putting a different sprocket on it. I don't know how many teeth he has on it. It originally had a 56 tooth sprocket on it. I have a 52 tooth that I'm probably going to be putting on it uh, for a little bit. Part of the reason that I have the wheel taken off is because the tire is flat and I don't have a good air compressor here that would be able to reinflate it. So I'm going to be taking it to work and, uh, and airing it up there. Other thing I'm going to be doing um, I'm going to be switching out this entire swing arm. This swing arm is currently set up to be a wheelie bar bike, but I don't want to be doing wheelie bar racing. So I'm going to be getting a whole new swing arm for it. I'm going to be removing the rear brake, and I'm just going to do grudge pegs. So it's actually going to put the, uh, the foot peg probably right about here. So you can kind of keep your feet behind you a little bit more, and you can get tucked down behind the windscreen a little bit more. But as of right now, that's really all I've got going on with it. Um, like I said, it's mostly the biggest part for me is going to be doing the swing arm and putting the original shock back in it. Because currently, I don't know if you guys will be able to see this, it has a solid shock in it. So that black bar right there is just a solid one piece bar that keeps the entire tail section rigid. It's pretty difficult to ride and it bounces around a lot. It is a very, very rough ride and I'm wanting to raise the bike up a little bit more and also make it kind of more of like a street strip type of bike, a bike that I can, you know, cruise around on the weekends with my friends on and also still take it to the drag strip and lay down some really good times. But that's really all I've got going on with the ZX-12R. Once I start doing more stuff with the swing arm, I'll definitely get some videos of it. And I'll also probably take a couple little videos of some things that I've got going on. You know, some of the smaller stuff just to keep you guys entertained in the meantime. But thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the little update, be sure to give the video a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos of this bad beast. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you later.